In this video, we're going to solve some problems involving lottery. For this lottery, we have 12 numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. And you get a ticket. Every ticket has three numbers from this list. If all the numbers match the winning set, you win. The first question is, what is the probability of you winning the lottery? You get a ticket and the winning set is announced. What's the probability of you winning? Let's try this. Pause the video. Okay, let's do this together. How many total tickets are possible? So we're picking three numbers out of these 12. So total number of tickets or total number of selections, that's going to be 12 C3. It doesn't matter in which order we pick the numbers. For example, a ticket could have three, four, and five. It doesn't matter if you pick five first or four first or three first, we're just picking these three numbers. Hence, we'll take selections. So total number of selections is 12 C3. That's the total number of different tickets there are. This is equals to 12, 11, 10 by 3, 2, 1. Dividing 12 by 6 will give us 2. 2 times 11 is 22 times 10. That's 220. So for this lottery, we have 220 different tickets. There's one ticket that matches the winning set. So what's the probability of us winning? The probability of us winning is we get that one ticket. That's going to be 1 divided by 220. Now this is approximately equal to 0.45% or slightly less than half percent. All right, here's the next problem. What's the probability of you winning this lottery if you get not one, but two tickets or even 10 tickets? Think about it. Okay, so if we get two tickets, the probability of us winning, that's going to be two divided by 220. The probability doubles. Similarly, if we get 10 tickets, the probability becomes 10 times. This becomes 4.5%. With this logic, if you buy all 220 tickets, our probability will be 220 by 220, that's going to be equal to one. Here's a different way of increasing our chances of winning. What is the probability of us winning if there are 10 winning sets? Suppose there are not one winning set, but 10 winning sets. What's the probability of us winning if we get a ticket? Think about it. Okay, because there are now 10 winning sets, the probability of us winning, that's going to be 10 divided by 220. 10 favorable outcomes by 220 total outcomes. That's going to be 4.5% approximately. Here's a different scenario. What is the probability of us winning at least once if we get two tickets and there are 10 winning sets? So we increase our number of tickets by one. We have now two tickets and there are 10 winning sets. Using whatever we have just discussed, try this one out. Okay, let's do this together. We want to figure out the probability of us winning at least once, which means we can win once if we get one matching ticket. We can win again if our second ticket also matches one of the winning sets. So how do we figure out the probability of us winning at least once? Here's a neat way of doing this. We can figure out the probability of us not winning at all and subtract that from one. So probability of us winning, that's going to be one minus probability of not getting a single winning ticket, which means we lose both the times. So one minus probability of not getting a single winning ticket. This is what we need. Now, how many sets are not winning? If there are 10 winning sets out of 220, this means there are going to be 210 sets that do not win. We pick two out of them. So that's one minus 210C2. We pick two out of the 210 that do not win. And the denominator is 220C2. We pick two out of all 220. So this becomes one minus 210 times 209 divided by 210 times 219, two times one cancel out. So this simplifies to 8.9% approximately. So this is our chance of winning at least once if we get two tickets and there are 10 winning sets. Here's the last problem of this set. What is the probability of us winning at least once if we get 10 tickets and there are 10 winning sets? We realized that there are 10 winning sets and we wanted to get lucky, so we bought 10 tickets. What's our chances of winning now? Pause the video, try this out. Okay, so probability of winning is equal to one minus probability of losing. That's probability of not getting a single winning set. So all 10 tickets lose. So we're picking losing tickets and losing tickets are 220 minus 10, that's 210. So this becomes one minus 210 C10. We pick 10 out of the losing tickets, that's 210. Divided by 220 C10, we pick 10 out of all 220. And if we simplify this, this becomes approximately 
So in this scenario, when there are 10 winning sets and we pick 10 tickets, the probability of us winning at least once is a significant 37.8%.